I wanted to ask you about an exchange that Kristen Welker, uh, the new moderator of Meet the Press, had with Trump that stuck out to me. Mm -hmm. um, so let's play that, and then we're going to talk about it on the other side. So you called some of your outside lawyers. You said they had crazy theories. Why were you listening to them? Were you listening to them because they were telling you what you wanted to hear? You know who I listened to myself? I saw what happened. I watched that election, and I thought the election was over at 10 o'clock in the evening. So this is interesting because he's oh, they've been using this advice of counsel argument. So what did you think about that exchange, Neil? So, so Jen, anyone who's any critic of Kristen Walker, meet the press, who's like, oh, she's not making news, she just made huge news this morning because Donald Trump's defense to January 6th has been one basic thing, which is I relied on the advice of my lawyers. I didn't have bad criminal intent. It's my lawyers who were telling me to do this. And she got him through masterful interviewing and playing to his ego to go, oh, no, I did it all myself. Yeah. And if you're Jack Smith this morning, you're going, thank you. That's what I always thought. And yes, you hired these kind of cockamamie, crazy lawyers. Mm -hmm. But at the end of the day, this was you through and through. This demonstrates his you know, culpability right there and then. And I think makes this case uh, that Judge Chutkin has going to trial on March 4th. A lot easier. Yeah, Donald Trump is losing his mind, right? Like he is in mental decline. He's not all there anymore. And even Republicans are going to have to start admitting it soon. Because last night at a speech, Donald Trump claimed that Biden is trying to arrest Barack Obama. Like, what is this guy talking about? Take a look at the clip. Joe Biden and the radical left thugs who have weaponized law enforcement to arrest their leading political opponent, They're leading by a lot, including Obama. Was, I'll tell you what. You take a look at Obama and take a look at some of the things that he's done. This is the same thing. The country is very... What? What? Biden's leading political opponent is Obama and Biden's trying to arrest Obama? Yeah, this guy's not okay. Oh, and that's not the only thing that happened last night. Donald Trump also claims that Biden is leading us into World War II. Yeah, take a look at the clip. History of our country who is cognitively impaired in no condition to lead and is now in charge of dealing with Russia and possible nuclear war. Just think of it. We would be in World War II very quickly. World War II? Buddy, you're like 80 years too late. So apparently Biden is running against Obama and trying to have him arrested. And apparently Biden's also leading us into World War II. That's according to Donald Trump. I just know that if President Biden said anything like this, Republicans would be freaking out. They'd be saying, oh, he's losing his mind. He's in cognitive decline. But when Donald Trump does it, they brush it off. They don't care. I mean, look, if Republicans really want to talk about candidates' mental state, I'm happy to have that conversation because your guy thinks we're going into World War II and that Obama is a leading candidate. That's what your guy thinks. Hey, look, we always knew that Donald Trump was crazy, right? Like no sane person believes the conspiracy theories he believes, but this is a new level. Something's not right there. And I really hope that Republicans call out Trump the same way that they go after President Biden.